Hello, my name is Terry. I'm with the Cold Truth Air Conditioning out of the Colony, Texas. We're looking at a field piece dual port manometer. We have it hooked up to a two-stage gas valve that has been converted to run with liquid propane. Uh, the manometer hooks up on top. It hooks up on bottom. So you get your inlet pressure, you get your outlet pressure. We used a 7 16 box wrench to hook up the manometer to the boss ports in the gas valve. They're not easy to get to, they're in the back, but we got them in tight and the manometer is reading good here. So as we see, we have 3.7 inches of water column exiting the gas valve. Okay. In the bottom right hand corner we have the difference of the pressure coming in. So it says we have about an 8 inches water column difference from the pressure coming in. So all together we've got about 11 and a half inches or 11 and 3 quarter inches water column feeding the furnace. 3.76 inches of water column is not enough when it comes to liquid propane furnace, not for low stage. For low stage this furnace in the book calls for six inches of water column. We're going to adjust that in the gas valve. We replaced the springs in this and we've replaced the adjustment screws. We put a liquid propane conversion kit in the valve. As so we tighten the adjustment screw, our gas pressure shoots up. We're almost at five. We want to be about six. Coming up on five and a half, coming up on almost six, okay, how about 6.0, that's pretty good, we're going to leave it there, 6.0. Alright, we have 6.0 coming out. The difference between the pressure coming in is 5.6. So all together we have 11.7 inches of gas pressure feeding this furnace. That's low stage. High stage wants a gas pressure of 10 inches of water column. We will set that as soon as we jumper it into high stage. We have jumpered the two-stage furnace to run in high stage. The inducer motor is coming on. It's going to close pressure switches over here. When this unit fires up, it's initially going to fire up in low stage. So we'll see our low stage pressure again. Pressure coming in is 11.9 going to fire up. Fires up in the low stage. There's the six inches of water column that we just set up and adjusted over here. It's about to kick into high stage and we'll see our inches of water column shoot up. The book calls for 10 inches of water column in high stage, so let's see what we get. Come on, high stage. There's high stage. 10.1 inches of water column. That's pretty good. We don't need to adjust it, but we're going to do it for the heck of it. Put our adjustment tool in the high stage adjustment port. It says high on it. We're looking here. We're 10.1. Let's come down to 10.0. There's 9.9. .9.
10.0 in high stage, uh, 6 in low stage. The dual port manometer seems to be reading real well. Responds quickly. It can also do uh, static pressure, but it was real important to measure the gas pressure at this house because this is a new construction house using liquid propane on a high efficiency system. You want everything to be just right. Uh, you want it right for safety reasons, you want it right for efficiency reasons. Uh, our flames look great, our pressure looks great. This is a great furnace and a great install.